This is Don Casanova, an Indian billionaire living in Dubai who has allowed us to experience what it's like to live his life. Frazier, nice to meet you, man. He started with showing us his multi-million dollar car collection. Look how crazy this is. Having one of these cars is wild enough, but to have your own custom room filled with lots of them, that is nuts. Just the cars in the back are worth $2 million. He then showed us the loudest car in the world. Any headphone users, please beware. Mate, my ears right now, I actually can't hear anything, bro. That was insane. I don't think I've ever heard anything that loud in my entire life, bro. I was like, I'm tripping out. For the normal person like me and you, the craziest thing about all of this is the cars. But to Don, it's the license plates. They're worth almost 10 times the car itself. Just look at how expensive this one is he's talking about. Sell it probably like 10 million. 10 million dirhams just for the license plate. The market, because it goes up and down. Yeah, just whatever someone A lot of people wants. do business on plates only. So if it's like a single digit, they can hit you like maybe 65, 70 million. Our brother Chana loves cars more than you think. His job is literally all about cars. All he does in his free time is watch videos on cars. What was about to happen next would make him cry. Yeah, imagine crying. <laughs> I've never, like, this is such a surreal experience. 12 million for this car. It's why it's a one out of three in the world. Man. One out of three men yeah. in the world. 1,600 horsepower. No one knows more about cars than Chan. We've never seen him this excited in our whole life. His reactions right now are priceless. Do you know what type of car this is? 12 uh, What car is that over there? That Bugatti. Okay, what car is that? That Lambo? Oh, uh, the Mansory, SV. What car is that Rolls Royce? I'm tripping. It was only right for Chana to sit inside Don's $12 million Bugatti. Chana is going to be the most excited to sit in this car. I have to see him. Let's get his real reaction of getting in. Yeah, squeeze yourself. <laughs> you are sitting in $12 million car of Bugatti. How does it feel, bro? Is your dream come true right now? <laughs> if you can fit. Chana is also six foot eight or nine. So. Chana fits pretty well. <laughs> How do you feel right now, Chana? Oh my God. And remember I told you guys about the license plates? This one on the car Chana is in is worth 18 million. Like, what does that mean? And you said this is one of how many in the world? One of those three. You might need some like, medical or something because I fully might have a heart attack while I'm showing my... He's actually having a heart attack right now. Jarvis, we got to keep Chandler okay. And my heart is... <laughs> Imagine if Chandler was in the Batmobile cave that we were at in Vegas when he saw like, you know, Ford, F1, all that stuff. He would have actually, I think, died. Click your fingers, bro. What? Yo! Don thought Chana's reactions were so funny and wholesome that he told us he's going to surprise us with something later. Yeah, even the tissue boxes are made out of like gold, man. This is crazy. I love this, man. Work neat. out right next to your $12 million car. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is like a full blown cinema. You got the. Bro, look at the stars of the ceiling in the cinema, bro. This is insane. Imagine just chilling up here. There's like a fridge for your water in your cup yeah. container. When have you ever seen oh, that? Bro, look at this bathroom, bro. Sink, bro. Everything right now is gold. This Sink is gold. The shower is gold. The pipes are gold. The handle gold. The tap is gold. It's not gold, but you got a gold yeah. hose shower there. Gold walls, man. Like the water looks gold because of the reflection. I'm washing my hands in gold. He even has a full length pool with a jacuzzi on the end and an underwater mini bar. sitting area, a mini bar, where he has people that can serve drinks and food. Why are chilling in the pool? Absolutely insane, man. It's the type of stuff you see in a resort when you're on a holiday, not in your own home, man. This is nuts. If that wasn't crazy enough, Don still had his favorite part of the house to show us, his diamond wall. That looks so oh, sick. So cool, man. I've never seen anything like that in my life. Don was telling us all about his house, how he designed it entirely himself, costing him $65 million. Just Don's house already had blown our minds and the day was just getting started. As we left his house, he had a surprise waiting for us. Don was kind of enough to lend us one of his cars he doesn't want for the week. Yeah, he doesn't really like the silver on it, so. Guys, sure. this is insane, you know what I'm saying? What is life? What, what, is, what life? is life? It was only right for Chana to be the driver of this car. As soon as we drove off, Don texted us an address to go to in downtown Dubai. He said that he has an even bigger surprise in store for us. I'm going to show you guys what type of your $15 million can get you right now. This thing is insane. Yo, look at this, bro. Get your own living room right off the dock as soon as you get in. A table, man. You can sit and eat dinner 
while you're out at sea. Like, how crazy is that? There is even their own kitchen right here, which is so cool. You have a TV while you're looking at that view, man. Like, out, like what, what, how crazy is this, bro? But this is the best part down here. Holy. When could you ever just lay in bed on a yacht, bro? Are you kidding me, man? You've got your own ensuite bathroom in here with a crazy shower, bro. Are you actually kidding me? You've got a TV for when you want to chill in your bed at this sofa, as well as a crazy walk-in wardrobe. And this is just the first bedroom. There is so much more to show you. Jarvis is on the top floor. We're going to go meet him right now, too. This is the second bedroom. You have your own bathroom in here as well. Absolutely nuts. A smaller closet, but still a closet on a boat with this crazy bed, man. Are you kidding me right now? Like, what? how is this real? The outdoor seating area, man. This is nuts. Holy. This is the lounge area on the front of the boat, man. How crazy is this, bro? Look at that. What is going on? How is this real? We're going to go and see up there where Jarvis is. <laughs> it's safe to say living like a Dubai billionaire is insane, but we still have the craziest thing of all left to do. Hamid Abdullah, another Dubai billionaire, has invited us to his multi-million dollar private suit. I'm in a line with the cage. I'm in a, yeah, you're in a cage with a line. I'm in a, yeah. I can't even think right. Well, Hello, wow. how are you doing, Hello. mate? Yeah. Bro, I can't move, yeah. mate. Yeah, I've got a lot of adrenaline. Yes. What is... Wow. Oh my God, it's terrorism. So we honestly thought going inside a cage with the lion was the craziest thing we do, but they told us to get ready because it was about to get crazier. The owners of the zoo then made everyone leave so they could let all of the lions out of the cages and free roam. No one in the world gets to do this. I have never been this nervous in my entire life like, what if one of these lions don't like me? While we were waiting for them to leave, Jarvis became best friends with this rare bird called Chapo. These are some of the rarest tigers in the world because they are albino. As you notice, they obviously don't have their normal color on them. The fact I was just petting it is actually insane. Wow, look at that, look at that. Mate, this is uh, absolutely crazy. Who in their life can ever say they have petted a tiger and a lion? I don't think. Oh, all right, I'm about to feed it milk. When it comes to the cost of these animals, they are priceless. You can't put a price tag on things like this. One of these was even gifted to Humaid by the royal family. Wow. Then, as we were petting some of the lions, one of them actually escaped. It's off the chain. It's off the chain. Oh. Have you ever seen a lion hug someone? Well, now you have. This is some of the craziest stuff I've ever seen, Jarvis, right? And of course, you aren't a Dubai billionaire unless you own the desert, which these guys do. They let us out on their fleet of ATVs to ride into the sunset. And I got this really cool pick. 